Oh, he's going through the whole entire daycare. Oh, okay. Down E. Oh, oh wow. In my tutorial page, really? So she decided she didn't want to finish the food. She wanted to make a mess. Cool. Bitch, I'm annual flossing. BBS. Yeah, I play Animal Crossing. GameCube 3DS. I ain't never been poor. Used to play Sims 4. Put a little wall around niggas take it. Go off, Trevor in a swim pool. Hey, what's up, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Sierra, or also known as Sierra the Simmer. Today, I'm going to be showing you functional items for your toddlers in the Sims 4 game. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and that bell so you don't miss another time I post. Now, let's get straight into this video. Okay, everybody, so as you can see, we are at a daycare. This build is by Bean Builds. It's called Little Dreamers Daycare. I am here with the daycare owner, Erica Plummer, and seven other toddlers, and they are going to be my models for this tutorial. The first item that I am going to show you is the Drink O Baby. Erica is already over by the Drink O Baby. This is the Drink O Baby. Basically, you can make functional drinks for your toddler. So, the first thing I'm going to have Erica do is put a toddler down into a high chair. I'm going to have her put down Paige. After she puts Paige down into this high chair, I'm going to have her click on the Drinko Baby. She can prepare a toddler drink. The options with the Drinko Baby is the Ikea Mouse Toddler Cup, Ikea Fox Toddler Cup, a Monkey Toddler Cup, Banana Strawberry Pouch, Sweet Potato Pouch, and a Strawberry Mango Pouch. After she gets done putting Paige into the high chair, I'm going to have her give her a Strawberry Mango Pouch. So that is how the drink baby works she goes over to it like a refrigerator opens it up she takes out the pouch once they take the pouch out they will put it somewhere random but all you'll have to do once she does set the pouch down is drag it over to the toddler that's at the high chair and put it next to them on their high chair the next thing i'm gonna have erica do i'm actually gonna teleport her right in front of the drink baby again and we're going to be introducing the nutra baby with the neutral baby this basically allows the sim to make food for the baby. It comes with eight new recipes, and both of these are by Around the Sims 4. The Drinko Baby is by Around the Sims 4, and the Neutral Baby is by Around the Sims 4. This allows you to prepare toddler meals. The options are Mush and Owl Plate, Mush and Ladybug Plate, Mush and Monkey Plate. You can actually, there's also more recipes that include mashed carrots and breaded tofu, peas and pizza, red lentils and gruyere mashed potatoes and ham, and lentils and beans. So since we put Paige down into the high chair, I'm going to actually have her make some peas and pizza. So she opens it sort of like a refrigerator. And like I said before, once they have it in their hand, they'll most likely put it in a random spot that's nearest to them. And she put it in this high chair. But in this case, we want it in the high chair where Paige is at. So Paige now has a strawberry and mango pouch. And she has peas and pizza. So we can actually, if you are controlling a toddler, you can click on Paige and have her eat the peas and pizza and drink the pouch. Now, I'm actually going to have her put down more kids here. So I'm going to have her put down Carter because he's very sad and I believe he's hungry. Then I'm going to have her put down Sarai. And these kids are going to eat. So this is um, Paige eating and drinking the pouch. She is now, well, currently she's drinking the pouch. So since Carter is now in his area, he's going to eat his lentil and bread. And then this is peas and pizza as well. So once she puts Sarai down into hers, and this is how you use the Drinko Baby and the Nutri Baby. Now, I'm also going to have her grab some drinks for the other toddlers. I'm going to have her drop, uh, get a Ikea mouse toddler cup for Sarai and then a fox toddler cup for Carter. Okay, so the next functional item that I do want to show is the play pin by Around the Sims 4. Now, these are the play pins right here. Literally, they keep your toddlers from going all over the place. So, we're going to just use a random toddler and we're going to put Blake and we're going to teleport him inside and he can't go anywhere. Like, if I click over here for him to go over here, he can't because he's stuck in the play pin. So, this basically allows you to keep your toddlers in one area. You can put toys in here for him to play. For instance, you can drag this 
functional you can drag the functional preschool painting and you can have him play with that or you can have him read but um let me show you if it works so i put this in here he can now stack and sort of be in his own little area so now blake is in there playing with his painting and he can't go anywhere so that's a good way to keep your toddlers in one area um the kids are not eating and i'm not sure what's going on but i'm actually gonna have sarai teleport over here oh she's in a high chair never mind um i'm gonna have her take her out let her out the next item that i want to show is the functional slide by around the sims 4 so i showed the drinko baby the nutrisystem the nutri baby i keep calling it the nutrisystem and the playpen the next item is the functional slide i'm gonna grab a random toddler and teleport them over here by the slide so with this slide the toddler will go on it they'll climb up on it And I'm actually going to have her let this toddler out. And she goes down it. So this is the functional slide by Around the Sims 4. They will slide down it and bam. And the next item is the ball pit. And I'm going to have the same toddler go on the ball pit. She wanted to go outside and play with the jungle gym. But I'm going to have her play with the ball pit. She's going to go over here and play in ball pit. So the ball pit is pretty um, simple. It comes with a game, but it's a recolor, making it look a little better. So she goes in, she jumps inside the ball pit, and balls pop up out of the ball pit, and she plays around in the ball pit. And look how happy she looks. Okay, so the next item that I am going to be talking about is the Little Chef Station by Panda Sama and Ravasheen. And I'm actually gonna have Sarai be the model for this since she already has her chef hat on. I'm gonna teleport her right here and she's going to either, you can, the options are either play kitchen or pretend to cook. I'm gonna have her play kitchen. And this is how it works. So she basically hops on top of a stack of books and she plays kitchen. And this is how it works. So she's like playing with a bowl of crayons and like crackers and graham crackers and she pretends to play kitchen. And that's how that works it's very cute for your sims to play with i think it's absolutely adorable this is by panda sama and rava sheen the next functional item that i want to show is also by panda sama it is the trampoline i'm going to grab a random sim to play with the trampoline she's already playing with the ball pit page is um open and available so i'm gonna teleport her here and i'm gonna have her play with the trampoline and i'm gonna show y'all how that looks so Paige is gonna hop on the trampoline usually she'll like it'll look like she's climbing on top of it like a bed and then she will jump up and down on it like a trampoline so this is by panda sama and it's very cute and i enjoy it and her diaper stinks <laughs> Um, the next item that I'm going to talk about is the toddler pool, which is by Neck Crow Dog. And I'm actually going to teleport a random sim over here to play with this pool. So you will just click on it and it'll say use. He's very angry. Okay. So they go inside of the functional pool and they play around in it. And, um... So yeah, that's pretty much that. The next item that I'm going to talk about is the bi functional bikes and cars by Warren K or Waronk. I'm not too sure how to pronounce it. But I'm actually going to have Sarai teleport here. And she's going to hop in this Camaro and ride around. So basically, they'll like go around. They'll hop into it sort of like a bike and they will ride around into the bike so this is her she'll ride around the city um <laughs> this is the only thing i'll say that is like a little odd about it they literally ride around the whole entire city this is not safe this is not okay um yeah so that is how the functional cars work by warrant she's riding back over to little dreamers daycare so the way to keep to get her to stop is you'll you can pause it and you can click for her to stop the action and she'll stop driving 
and she'll still be inside of it. But the next thing that you'll do to make her come back is you'll click for have her to bike back to her area. And she'll do that. So she'll just pull up and bike back to her area, go straight through the gate and bikes right where you told her and she'll park. And to have her get out, you'll just have her go here and she'll get out the bike. And she'll return back. In the next item, since Paige is done with the trampoline, I'm actually going to have her ride on this toddler bicycle. She's using her diaper. <laughs> um, so once she gets done filling her diaper, I'm going to have her ride the toddler bicycle. Then I'm going to have Sarai come over here and ride on this bicycle. We can have him ride on this bicycle. You'll have to move it for them to be able to get to it, but you can have them ride on the ride around on the bicycle. So we have Paige who's riding around on the bicycle, and yeah, so they'll ride around the city basically, <laughs> um, and it'll be the same way that I showed for the car for her to get back out of it. Um, so Rai can get on this tri. This is a tricycle. She can ride around on the tricycle, and the way that she gets in it is sort of similar to how she got into the car. She'll basically hop onto it and go so yeah and then um they'll all ride around the city um Paige is riding around Sarai's riding around so these are just a few cute things that your sims can do next the last item that i'm going to talk about are the books by around the sims 4 they are not necessarily functional items they are already uh, functional books in the game but these are just extra books with different titles by around the sims 4 um and one of the books is called little brown bears and it comes with other titles monkey brown on the monkey bars this is another book um the only toddler i believe i have that has um a high imaginary skill the child has to have a high imaginary skill in order to read the book um but yeah so in a way to cheat up the need for the imaginary skill, you can click on the toddler, go to MC Command Center, go to Cheats, go to Cheat Sim Info, go to Skill Cheats, and Set Skill. And you can set the imaginary skill to 5, even though the toddler only needs 2 to actually be able to read the book on them on their own. And I'm actually going to test out with Blake. So Blake is currently using his diaper, but I have the book in another child's inventory. You just put the book in the playpen. And you can have him read Monkey Brown on the Monkey Bars after he finishes fin filling up his diaper. He's going to sit down and read the book finally. So this is a book by Around the Sims 4. The child will go through the book and read the pages. It's so cute and so adorable. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. This is like the second time I did this tutorial. I'll show the bloopers after this. And I will see y'all in my next video. And her diaper is stinking. All right. Looks like she's enjoying it. She's smiling. Cool, cool. Looks like little strips of pizza, some peas, some fruit. I don't know what that is, but <laughs> I don't know what it is next to the pizza. But this is what it looks oh, like. Eat. Oh, oh wow! In my tutorial page, really? So she decided she didn't want to finish the food. She wanted to make a mess. Cool. And then there's a little baby doll that comes with her around The Sims Four. And that is what Miss Leilani is playing. She's playing with this little doll, which is sort of just like you know an override or. Um, a recolor of a doll that came with the game. So she's about to go back to the daycare. Oh, she's going through the gate. Okay, sis. All right. <laughs> oh, he's going through the whole entire daycare. Okay.